OK, let's have a look at the retouch options. Now, I'm a little bit apprehensive about doing this class because I think you guys are perfect the way you are. But it's also important that I show you everything that this app can do. So first thing we're going to do is we're just going to look at the different options. So this is smoothing my chin and it's strengthening my chin. Let's have a look at the nose feature. So as you can see, it's uh, changing the shape of my nose. Now, I have quite a big nose. It's quite Romanesque. So this is appealing to me, but it's really important that we're we're happy with what we've got. So again, I'm showing you this because I think it's important that you know uh, what the app can do. But you know, I would encourage you to be really sparing with this because you are already perfect. Okay, so I'm just touching the eye. Just look if I'm just moving the eyebrows up there and you can do different things with the eyebrows. I mean, luckily this picture is quite far away so you don't notice too much of this. Okay, so I've just clicked the smooth feature. So that's going to take a little bit of time now. So it's just loading and it's analyzing my features and my face and it's going to make me look uber smooth and less worn, shall we say, less wearing the world on my face. And depending on how complex your image is will depend on, on how long this takes. Now that's unavailable because I think the image is too far away. So let me do this manually. So I'm just going to increase, increase the brush size here so you can see how it works. If I just brush my head and obviously that's quite a thick brush. So let me just do a, a finer brush and you'll see, watch these wrinkles and they are gone. Voila, they disappear. Okay, let's have a look under the eyes and there you go. So this is kind of like a cloning tool really. So it kind of just smooths over that skin, which, you know, is it's a great feature if you're shooting models or you're doing uh, portrait photography and people are a little bit nervous about the way they look. This is a really good feature. Eye bag, it tells you everything. It's about getting rid of those bags under the eyes. Again, this image is quite far away. So let me zoom right in, have a look at these bags under these eyes. That tells a story, doesn't it? So I'm just going to brush that and you'll see already, if it's a close-up image, it actually does make those bags under the eyes disappear and you can retouch the skin and you know you can move across and you can face fix and you can fix blemishes or you can change the color of somebody's hair. So again, I'll do this super quick, but there's a little bit of a red tint to my hair and I can go blue. Why wouldn't you match my uh, denim shirt there, for example, or I might want to go green. And again, this is super quick from my side. So I could play with, you know, the, the features and the opacity of that. You know, I can even change my eye color and teeth whiten. I'm not showing my teeth in this image, obviously, but if somebody was showing their teeth, you could whiten their teeth. So the application for this is great if you're taking portrait photography of somebody, you just want to enhance somebody's images. If you're doing it on yourself, please be sparing. Please don't overdo it because again, like I've said a couple of times, you are awesome the way you are. Okay, let's jump into the next session.